And what is going on, guys? This is All Elite Ruby for Wolfpack Productions, where you guessed it, you can be sure big things popping, little things stopping. And today, T E Dub. I want to try this under a different editing software here. <coughs> Excuse me. And uh, we're gonna we're booking Lightning eighty seven. Now, for those that weren't with us, I'm gonna introduce my champions again. They are on the Canadian brand. It is Brandy Danielle's their champion. And then the Provincial Tag Champions are Rachel and Jessica's excellent tag team, or Rachel Summerlin and Jessica James. <clears throat> Our current River Brawl holders, Veda Scott. The Tag Team Championships belong to Allie Kay and Lauren Harris. Hang on. <coughs> Sorry about that. Anyway, the Tag Team Champions are the MVPs, Allie Kay and Lauren Harris from the WWI America brand. Your Television Championship, which is attached to Canada, is Soraya Knight. U.S. Champion, help me say this in the comments. Is it Slazia Sparks? I may just short her name to just Sparks. I have no clue how to say her first name. Anyway. <clears throat> AJ Harris is our WWI Champion. And, of course, I've done all the champs. Now it's time to re-meet the roster for you guys. It's Adrian Riley. AJ Harris. <clears throat> Adrian is a Patriot gimmick, as it says there. AJ Harris is a dancer, but I'm about to turn her heel and give her her seductress character that I've got her working in WWE 2K. She's a dancer now, but I'm about to change that. Anyway, we've got Aaliyah. Everybody knows Aaliyah. I'm glad I'm about to change her gimmick. <clears throat> we have Ali K, who's part of the MVPs. Angelina Love. Doesn't have a gimmick. Angel Larie, my 80s rocker chick. Ashley Brooks, aka Dana Brooke. Perfect body gimmick there. Brandy Danielle, who is the w WI Canadian champion. <clears throat> now, most of these are going to be cause. I'll introduce the cause because everybody already knows basically the other part. Anyway, Camilla Sindel is a rock star chick. Courtney Rush. I signed Dahlia Black, but she's out on maternity leave. Uh, let's see, Erin Stone, who is a businesswoman, as you see there. Jamie Lee and Jesse Sinclair's sisters both work in the British Bulldog character. Jordan Meadows is an MMA chick. And I don't feel no shame, it's a mood you lack I go crazy, nah, but I ain't lazy Track after track, I work on this shit daily Pass me the jack, right as fuel, got me hazy About to unpack all these shit I've been chasing I've got visions in my head Like memories after death To be a legend instead Of something you can forget I'm living up every breath I'd rather lead than be led I'll fill the seats as I spread With every word that I've said
first match of the night here. Just want to kick it off with what should be a barn burner. As Adrian Riley takes on Lauren Harris, and I expect these two to steal the damn show. Do it, ladies. <clears throat> I don't care who wins, steal the damn show for me. And then we're going to hear from our MVPs as we find out who they're going to defend against at the pay per view. <clears throat> Excuse me. You know what? I'm going to do something a little different here. We're going to do the two rocker chicks. This should be a pretty good promo battle, then. I can't wait to see the rating on this thing. That set. Now let's just see how Cammy and Angel do as a team. Now, may, may, now, take into note. I think I said this in the last episode. This is actually an all women's brand or all women's company. So we're the we're testing Camilla Sandel and Angel Larry as as a team to see how they do. And I've got to do a gimmick change anyway for two people. So we're gonna go ahead and do it as Kelly and Brooke. Right, let me change the. Well, we're gonna take the. You know, I'll just take that off and edit it out, and just rename the team, I guess. <clears throat> All right, that should do it. I've got a better idea for a team that we can do that with. I know Lauren's got another match and I don't care because I want to try this. Seriously, high impact needs some time. I know there's some of... Some out there, someone out there watching that knows who High Impact is that absolutely agrees with that sentiment. Even though AJ is a heel in this, they broke out to be. And now we get to hear from your main event for the next pay per view. Who that? Ironically, I say, ironic that I say that because I have a New Orleans Saints shirt. <laughs> <coughs> AJ is going to be defending her championship. And she'll defend that thing against... Hmm. Lexi Loren will be fine. Hmm, sorry. A little tired. And there's your... We have one more match we need to do. <clears throat> Lexi's gonna main event. And then this episode, I, I forgot to say, we're gonna book as probably one Thunder and one Lightning, and that'll be enough for the episode. But I'll have AJ work two times because I want to see how this does. Eh, not a very good start. I thought that actually did it though. That may do just do its job and just steal the dang show. Another good rating there. Yes. That was it. That was it, folks. Solid show. <laughs> A 78 overall is pretty damn good for me, I guess. <coughs> 
Solid show. Let's see if Thunder can top it. And we're going to take a bit of a jump cut all the way up to Thunder. I'll see you guys in a bit. Oh, I misspoke. It's TakeOver Canada's turn. Okay. Oh, Canada. That was way for that. Anyway. I'm going to start off with the Canadian Tag Team Champions. The Provincial, I think. Well, yeah, that's what it's called. I don't know. Aaliyah is the NWA. I'm trying to figure out who the. <clears throat> now let yeah, let's go ahead and do that. But I'm gonna put them against two people that can help the match out. <clears throat> no, I'm not gonna lead off with this. I got a better idea. Tell them to do as usual in this first match is steal the show. <clears throat> of course, like I said, it's for the TV championship. And then Jen and Soraya are gonna come by and have a little chat. As we go into our next matchup, which is going to be for the Tag Team Championships. We're doing that one right now. <clears throat> Let's see here. How about a little TNT? Tanara and Tessa Blanchard. I'm going to get heat for having her on the roster, but I don't give a shit at this point. That's a good hand that Rachel Summerlin will defend. the provincial tag team titles and then we're going to hear from Ruby Soho talking to the general manager about something of course Jensen's there as the owner <coughs> as is our general manager Jesse Sinclair Ruby will be told that she's going to have to earn that championship match here tonight. Up next, actually. Ruby Ruby, Ruby Soho. And how will she do that? Against... Dun, 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 dun. Yep, yeah, Lacey Evans. Ruby wins the match. And will earn her title match at the winner. She is the winner of Jensen versus Soraya at the next Canadian Takeover. <clears throat> but next up, we got that championship, baby. As Brandy Danielle defends the ship. But the question is, who does she get to defend against? It's Rachel Rose, of course. Because of course it is. And looking at the timer, this is more than likely going to be the last show we're going to book this episode. I'm trying to keep them down so it doesn't take me too long to upload them. <clears throat> anyway, let's take a look and see what our final show gets. 70. Eh, could have done better with that. But it'll be Jensen Lane and Ruby Soho. Make a note of that. Tanara and Ve okay, nice. So TNT have some good comp, some good things going there. T TNT, Tanara and Tessa are the new tag team champions.
And of course, the main event absolutely stole it. I should have let off with that. Our final rating is a 77. And guys, that's going to do it for this episode of TWWWI. Until next time, guys, like, comment, subscribe, follow me on Twitter, do all of that. And you guys, have a great day, and I'll see you later. Bye-bye, everyone.